photoelectric effect by no everything photoelectric effect the photoelectric effect refers to the phenomena in which electrons are emitted from the surface of a metal when light strikes it so let's understand this definition with the help of a diagram suppose this is a metal surface when light strikes on the metal surface the emission of electrons takes place so this phenomena is called as photoelectric effect but this is not a simple phenomena there are few parameters when they meet only then photoelectric effect takes place let's see the explanation of photoelectric effect photoelectric effect can be explained by assuming that electromagnetic radiation is quantized means it consists of photons and that the threshold frequency represents the minimum energy required to remove the electrons from the metal surface so photoelectric effect can be explained with the help of electromagnetic radiation so let's assume electromagnetic radiation is quantized means it consists of photons and the photons have minimum threshold frequency hence they have minimum energy which is required to remove the electron from the metal surface so minimum energy required to remove an electron from the metal surface is e not which is equal to h nu not e not represents the energy which is required to remove the electron from the metal surface and it is possessed by the photon and photon have the minimum threshold energy when it has minimum threshold frequency that is nu not because a photon with energy less than e not cannot remove an electron light with a frequency less than the threshold frequency produces no electron a photon with energy less than e not means it has frequency less than nu not and hence the light which possesses the photons with a frequency less than the threshold frequency produces no electrons from the metal surface on the other hand suppose for light where nu is greater than nu not the energy is in excess of that which is required to remove the electrons is given to the electrons as kinetic energy means there are two scenarios one scenario is that when photon has less energy than e not and other scenario is that when the light has frequency greater than the required frequency in that case in second case the energy is in excess so that excess energy is given to the electron as kinetic energy so we have a equation for kinetic energy of electron which is given by photon so kinetic energy of electron is equal to half mv square which is equal to h nu minus h nu not so let's see what does this equation means so in this equation Ke represents the kinetic energy of the electron. M is the mass of the electron, V is the velocity of the electron, and H nu is the energy of the incident photon, which is greater than the threshold energy required to remove an electron from the metal surface. And H nu not is the energy required to remove the electron from the metal surface. So we can see from this equation. the kinetic energy possessed by the electron is the difference between the required energy to remove the electron and the excess energy which is present in the photon is given to the electron as kinetic energy so there are two scenarios of light frequency or energy first is light with frequency less than the threshold frequency produces no electrons let's understand this with the help of a diagram there is a metal surface when a light strikes on it so in this case the frequency of light is low less than the threshold frequency required so it produces no electron now let's see the other case light with frequency higher than the threshold frequency causes electrons to be emitted from the metal surface let's see with the help of diagram now this is again the metal surface and light strikes it 
but this time this light is with high frequency and emission of electrons takes place so what we have understood that the photoelectric effect will take place only when the light frequency is higher than the threshold frequency characteristics of photoelectric effects so there are few characteristics of photoelectric effect let's understand them one by one first no electrons are emitted by a given metal below a specific threshold frequency mu not so every metal has a threshold frequency required to remove the electron from its surface for light with frequency lower than the threshold frequency no electrons are emitted regardless of the intensity of the light what does it mean first thing the intensity of light is a measure of the number of photons present in a given part of the beam a greater intensity means that more photons are available to release the electrons as long as mu is greater than mu naught for the radiation so we can understand the intensity of light with the help of a diagram suppose it is a light source and we have a metal surface when light falls from light source on the metal surface it has photons in its beam this is a light beam which is falling on the metal surface it has specific numbers of photons in its beam so these are the photons so we can understand the intensity of light is the measure of the number of photons present in given part of the beam so we can see these are the number of photons which is present in this part of the beam so it it refers to intensity of that light greater intensity means there are more photons in particular area of the beam and they are available to release the electrons but these photons should have frequency greater than the threshold frequency which is mu not so what we have understood whether the photons are large in number in a light beam but they have less frequency compared to the required frequency then no electron will be emitted next characteristic is for light with frequency greater than the threshold frequency the number of electrons emitted increases with the intensity of the light for light with frequency greater than the threshold frequency the kinetic energy of the emitted electrons increases linearly with the frequency of the light so what we understand by these two points the light frequency with greater than the threshold frequency the number of electrons emitted increase with the intensity of the light why the increase because it has more number of photons with threshold frequency on the other hand the kinetic energy of the emitted in electrons increases linearly with the frequency of the light thanks for watching like share and subscribe